people thinking that this time they're going to back the currency with gold. And the question is how much gold do the BRICS nations have and the ones that are already part of it. And as of the first quarter of 2024, the combined central bank gold holdings of the original BRICS nations, plus the five new ones that were added in January accounted for nearly 17% of all the gold held in the world's central banks. But all currencies, all government debt-based currencies are based on that right now. And you know, the plumbing for the global financial system, what's gonna be really interesting is to see when the new system is turned on and the old system that's dollar centric is turned off. That's what we have to prepare for, especially those of us that live in the US. You wanna prepare? Global financial power is shifting and the BRICS nations are at the forefront of this change. As they prepare for their next major meeting, the question on everyone's mind is, will they finally unveil a gold-backed currency? With their combined gold reserves now dwarfing the rest of the world, they're laying the groundwork for a seismic shift in the global economy. What happens to the US dollar, and how will this impact your financial future? In this video, Lynette Zhang delves deep into the implications of this move, exposing how a potential crisis could push the world into a new financial era. If you're concerned about the security of your wealth, this is the wake-up call you need. Stay tuned, because what's coming next could change everything. And it's so important to have sound money these days, particularly with what's happening with the status of the dollar. But I always get all of these questions about BRICS, especially when they're having their meeting and people thinking that this time they're going to back the currency with gold, et cetera, et cetera. And eventually that will happen. And we'll be talking more about Zimbabwe as well, because it's when all confidence in the currency is lost, then they use gold to regain that confidence confidence. But the BRICS conference coming up in October, you know, more nations are interested in joining the BRICS because the U.S. has really shown what their true position is. And the fact that many developing countries are joining in a big number is sending a signal that something might have been wrong with the current world system and that different ways of doing things must be found. Yeah, you want to know the real way that you need to be doing things something backing money with gold and silver, mostly gold and having it convertible. So we're coming up into this new BRICS meeting. Are they going to announce that it will be backed by gold? Well, I scoured the internet and so far I couldn't really find anything definitive saying that, but how would a new BRICS currency affect the US dollar? It could easily take it over and probably will. And the question is, how much gold do the BRICS nations have and the ones that are already part of it? And as of the first quarter of 2024, the combined central bank gold holdings of the original BRICS nations, plus the five new ones that were added in January, accounted for nearly 17% of all the gold held in the world's central banks. Russia, India, and China rank in the top 10 for central bank gold holding. What does that tell you? That tells you that they are getting into a position to have the confidence in global currency shift their way. What do you think? The US dollar backed by gold? No flipping way, it's backed by debt. But all currencies, all government debt-based currencies are based on that right now. All of that debt must be burned off in order to then shift into a gold backed currency. That means they have to completely destroy your confidence in order for that to happen. Will they do it? Mm -hmm. Yes, they will. They need a huge crisis that scares you so much that they can shove anything that they want down your throat. It is critically important that on a global basis, we form community and create a quiet and peaceful revolution simply by converting all of this fiat money garbage into sound money, gold and silver that is truly decentralized outside of the system 
and most important, invisible, and it holds your purchasing power intact like it has for thousands of years. So we'll see what happens in this next BRICS meeting. Are we moving toward that? Yes, they're putting in the plumbing and you know, the plumbing for the global financial system, what's going to be really interesting is to see when the new system is turned on and the old system that's dollar centric is turned off. That's what we have to prepare for, especially those of us that live in the U S you want to prepare food, water, energy, security, barter ability, wealth preservation, community, and shelter. Get that local community done so that you can create freedom by being as independent and self-sufficient as possible. So that when these central banks that has beaten us to a pulp say jump, you have to, you can say, nope, not gonna. We need to have a seat at this table, whether it's the BRICS nations moving it forward, whether it's the US centric dollar moving it forward, whether it's the IMF with their SDR, which is the one that I really think is going to be the world reserve currency. But anyway, the only way we have a snowball's chance of having an impact is this quiet revolution. Get it done determine your goals and then build your portfolio to support those goals. And until next we meet, I a hundred percent know that we can make a positive difference for a lot of people, including a lot of generations to come. And until next we meet, please be safe out there. Bye-bye. As the BRICS nations continue to challenge the global financial order, the potential for a gold-backed currency grows stronger. The world is shifting, and those who prepare will be the ones to thrive in the new economy. Lynette Zhang has laid out the risks and the opportunities. Now it's up to you. Will you protect your wealth with sound money like gold and silver, or be left vulnerable to the coming storm? Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay informed as we navigate these uncertain times together. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.